Philippines, Peru, Romania, Rwanda, St. Vincent and the Grenadines, Sierra Leone, Sri Lanka, Thailand, Ukraine, and Vietnam. Are there any applicants whose country I have not called? Cote d'Ivoire. Is there anyone else? Canada. Canada. Please remain standing. Supervisor Clovis, on behalf of the United States government, it is my honor and privilege to present these 77 applicants from 34 countries for naturalization. Each applicant has been personally examined under oath by a designated officer. Each one has demonstrated an understanding of the English language and knowledge and understanding of the fundamentals of history, principles, and form of government of the United States. Each one has been found to be a person of good moral character attached to the principles of the Constitution of the United States and well disposed to the good order and happiness of the United States. Therefore, Supervisor Clovis, on behalf of the government of the United States, I respectfully recommend that upon taking the oath of allegiance, all applicants be admitted as citizens of the United States of America. Congratulations to you all. Thank you, Ms. Craig. I accept your recommendation. And now, this is your big moment. Are you all ready? Okay, raise your right hands and repeat after me. I hereby declare on oath that I absolutely and entirely renounce and abjure all allegiance and fidelity to any foreign prince, potentate, state or sovereignty. Of whom, or which, of whom or which I have heretofore, I have heretofore been a subject, or citizen, been a subject or citizen, that I will support and defend, support and defend the, Constitution and laws the Constitution and laws of the United States of America, of the United States of America against, all enemies, against all enemies, foreign and domestic. Foreign and that I, will bear true faith that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same. And to the same. That, I that I will bear arms on behalf of the United States, the United States. When, required when required by the law. That I will perform work, I'm sorry, perform non-combative services, services in the armed forces of the United States. When required, by the law, when required by the law, that I will perform work of national importance under civilian direction when required by the law, and that I take this obligation freely <laughs> without any mental reservation for <laughs> purpose of evasion. So help me God. Congratulations, Mr. Take a moment to congratulate your neighbor or somebody in front of you or behind you. You're all new citizens. <laughs> Melissa. And please have a seat when we finish. <laughs> 